We confirmed some of the known prognostic factors, so patients with pelvic Ewing have a poorer local control and poorer overall survival, the same as the case for patients with primary metastases with large tumors defined as a volume of about uh, over 200 milliliters at the uh, time of diagnosis. Um, a poor response to neoadjuvant chemotherapy. Interestingly, what we also saw, what uh, is not so well known until now, was that uh, modifications of treatment. We had a lot of patients who um, didn't proceed to finish the protocol as planned, either due to toxicity or because the patients were simply fed up with the treatment and didn't want to uh, uh, be in the hospital for uh, on and off for a year. And these patients had a worse local control and a worse overall survival probability. And we also saw that um, um, some surgical factors also had an influence. For instance, patients with presenting with a pathological fracture of the involved bone um, had a poorer overall survival, but not a worse local control. So that would suggest that um, the pathological fracture is a marker for an aggressive disease.